Hello and welcome back to the channel. Today you find us and the Westies taking a brief stop at the lovely Nern Beach. Although the camera didn't pick it up, we did see a colony of dolphins swimming in the Moray Firth. Nern has a small marina and we managed to find a little cafe open where we could have a drink and take in the views of the beach. We then decide to take a 20 minute drive to Fort George. Fort George was built following the Battle of Culloden in 1746 and the defeat of the Jacobites led by Bonnie Prince Charlie. George II wanted to create the ultimate defence against further Jacobite unrest. Fort George, it is said to be the mightiest artillery fortification in Britain, if not Europe. The fort has never been attacked and has remained in continuous use as a garrison. The barracks are still in use as a military base, however much of the site is open to the public. There is a military museum which is located in the former Lieutenant Governor's house and it is packed full of historical exhibits and displays which we found very informative indeed. And again, there's something for Outlander fans. and I were amazed at how many displays there were in the museum from bagpipes to drums to medals, pictures, clothing. It really is impressive and I would advise you if you're in Inverness to actually go and visit.
The fort is situated right on the Moray Firth, looking out to sea. And as you can see, um, walking around the perimeter, the inside perimeter, there's cannons everywhere. It is quite a vast area. I was surprised actually how big it was. And looking at the Moray Firth, dolphins apparently swim from Nairn all the way up the Murray Firth and you can regularly apparently see them swimming. So some facts for you. Entrance fee was £9.50 for each of us, however I would check for any concessions that perhaps you might be able to get. Dogs went free. Uh, there are permitted outside but not in any of the buildings. Opening times when we were visited was 10am till 4pm. There is a cafe and a gift shop where we found the staff to be very friendly and knowledgeable. Fort George has its own regimental chapel and this is also open to the public. Well this is where we leave you on this little video. Thanks very much for watching and don't forget to give us a thumbs up if you like it. Please consider subscribing. Don't forget to leave us a comment and you can share our video if you like it. And until next time We'll see you soon. Bye for now.